Great Britain ratifies the UPC agreement and joins the single EU patent system. I'm Rolf Klesen, partner with Freischem and Partner, and this video is about the UK joining the UPC agreement. As you all know, the EU member states tried for decades to establish a unified patent system where there is only one patent for all EU countries. And recently it looked like that the such patent system could be established until the UK voted for the Brexit to leave the EU. And the UK was a substantial, very important part of the UPC agreement. Um, and the UPC agreement is important to establish the whole patent system. Then people thought maybe we need another couple of years to establish such a system without the UK. But surprisingly, on November 29th of 2016, Baroness Lucy Neville Rolf announced that the UK will ratify the UPC agreement. That comes as a big surprise. Only two uh, member states still have to ratify the, U uh, the UPC agreement, which is the UK and Germany. And Germany already has all instruments in place and ready to ratify the agreement. And uh, of course people thought that the UK would never really ratify the, U um, the UPC agreement because they probably would not be part of the whole system after the Brexit. But to everyone's surprise, the UK um, is ratifying the agreement, hoping that maybe the EU will be more generous uh, with regard to um, the whole um, exit process and the negotiations with the EU. Baroness Neville Rolf said, For as long as we are members of the EU, the UK will continue to play a full and active role she also said the Brexit deal should involve free trade in goods and services. We want to give British companies the maximum freedom to trade with and operate in a single market and let European businesses do the same in the UK. So what does that mean in practice? The UPC will probably come into force um, in the end of 2017 or the beginning of 2018. And shortly thereafter, it is expected that the UK will exit the EU. Um, but that really doesn't matter for the system to survive, because um, the most important thing is that the UK ratified the agreement. And then the agreement will be in force and people can use the new system. So in following videos, I will elaborate on what patent owners should know about the new system and how they prepare to use the system or should they use the system, should they not use the system. I will go into more details in future videos. If you are new to my channel and you want to be updated on patents, trademarks and designs, please don't hesitate to subscribe to my channel. If you like the video, hit like. If you have questions or comments, I will answer them gladly under this video and most importantly, Protect your intellectual property and go make it count.